Hi, I am here from Kalida. Today in this video, I am going to show you how we can put different menus in different pages in WordPress. Not only in the pages, you can put different menus in full of pages, blogs and many many options are available here. Suppose, this is my home page as you can see. Suppose, when I am in the home page, I don't want the shop option and this pro cart button. So, you can do this by just using one free plugin and when you are in the shop support you do not want this account or members or profile then you can also easily do this so it can also help you support if you have a core if you had a course website and you do not want to have any distraction in the course space support you do not want to have home about contact us button in the menus in the course sections you just want to have a search bar then you can easily do with this so you can also add a distraction free interface to the users so that they can not be irritated when they are in the specific space then they can get a specific option for the specific face so it is very good feature so at first you need to download and install one plugin called conditional manage just you can just click on add new and install it is very easy to install you can just get so here as you can see here is conditional menus so as you can see i got this option here called conditional menus you can just click here and you can see about conditional menus and read about and lots of options and here is appearance and in the menus you will get all the options here so i have have right only one menu so i need to create one menu for shop page let me type shop and create menu and in the shop page i can just type home i do not want to have account i do not want to have this cart because there is already cart and here is the checkout i want this checkout login logout i do not want members i want password reset and product dashboard and register and shop page only this and i want to have here as you can see i can now align it perfectly suppose i do not want to have this login for logged in users and i do not want to have this logout for logged out users and i do not want to have password set for log out users and i do not want this part product dashboard for logged out users and i want this only for logged out user register also and here is login okay i don't I do not want logged in, in login for log login user. i want to have for logged out users so here i am going to align it right now register checkout i think i do not want to have this checkout for logged out users And I'm going to align it like this. So let me save menu. So you will not see any effect here right now. So let's go to manage location. And here is the primary menu. Primary menu means this menu. And here is the secondary menu, mobile menu, and footer menu. You can obviously do with that, but in this video, I'm just going to with the primary menu. And here is one called conditional menu. So just click on add conditional menu and just choose the menu. My is shop. And here is the condition. So here is in which page you want to have this menu. Suppose you can have home page, Facebook search page, tag, and lots of options are here. So I'm going to just click on pages. So I want to have this for suppose shop page, product dashboard page, cart page and checkout page and let me save it and shape changes and now when I refresh here you can see I only got home shop checkout so here as you can see home shop checkout and here is the this i made a mistake here shape changes let me refresh here and as you can see so again mistake here 
and mistake here and let me save menu and refresh here so as you can see i got this when i go to home page as you can see i got the previous option again so you can create lots of menus with the help of this trick so let's create different menu for the 404 page suppose i go to any website that is not in my website as you can see i do not want this home shop checkout and many options i do not want to have so i can just click on create new menu and let's create a new menu for for a page and let me choose home and i do not want to log in log out here home shop only this okay and let me save here now i need to put manage location here condition menu just choose 404 and in the condition i want to have only 404 page shape changes as you can see i only got home and shop in the 404 page but i got all the options in home page and suppose i do not want you can also choose other condition here are other like home page and tag archive here is the pages you can also choose for categories tags portfolio and here are other categories and you can also have post types for taximonies and user roles many many options are here suppose if you are the author then you can also put menu for you only means if you are the administrator you can put menu for you only so it is very useful when you not when you do not want extra stuff in your website as an administrator or if you want to have for the customer to have different menu then you can put here as well suppose you can also put like your one dashboard also so i can just click on edit menus and i'm just click on create new menu i want to create for only admin let me create menu and here i just want home and here is the account and i do not want card because i'm not going to buy anything here again log out i do not want login because i am administrator and here it's account logout and i want to see members password reset and i do not want product dashboard and here is the shop and user let me add to menu and here is the i can just type profile and here i want to have one custom link so i want to just type dashboard and here in the link text i want to have this url so you can easily manage your website with this also so as you can see so here in the navigation label that was a typo and let me say menu and in the manage location i want to have a condition menu and admin conditions and i can just go to user roles administrator save and shape changes here and when i refresh this page right now as you can see i got home account logout and all these options i can click on this dashboard so i think i did some mistake here yeah wp hyphen admin i forgot to add that let me click on save menu and i think i want i should just align it like this now it is perfect in my opinion and let me refresh here as you can see i got different options as a administrator and also dashboard when i click on the dashboard i'll be redirected to the space you can also have a personal good experience with this plugin i can just copy it when i'm not an administrator you can see the effect as you can see i did not got that option that is having at the administrator 
So I hope you like this video, then do not forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. And if you want to get more videos related to WordPress and to get more tips and tricks related to WordPress, then please subscribe, like and share this video. And thank you for this video. Stay tuned. Goodbye.